SKD rocking the bomber. Oh, yeah. Looking all nice aesthetic with now, the PG shirt underneath. Both, both sponsor shirts, both yes. sponsor jerseys are in the, you know, the, they're a little hidden, but they're there. They're in the they heart. They are definitely there. Now, it's going to be Azure versus Ezioi, and we've seen this so many times before. We saw this um, Frosty Faustings, Frosty Faustings. final round. Anime Ascension? No, Anime Ascension was Record Day. Record Day, Record Day, yeah. Um, final round. And uh, Evil last year. Evil last Evil year. Evil last year. Um, record, uh, SKD managed to clutch out the win for America versus Del Grosso. You know, I'm rooting for him. I hope he can do it again. Now, so Dogra has the utmost respect for SKD, uh, saying, you know, like, he's probably the strongest. Uh, he's stronger than him. That's what he's saying. I think more than anything, Dogra finds so much success in the tournament because he's a le really level-headed guy. Yeah. You know, he doesn't get very upset. He doesn't get very afraid on the tournament nerves. And he just kind of always plays at an extremely high level, regardless of the circumstance. Yep. Whereas SKD, his technical ability may be superior, but he is a, he's vulnerable to, you know, to the choke. Yes. So if he can keep his game plan clean and just... Wow. Growler, just to test out how uh, good your media is. Oh, a good 2A there, or jump A there. SKD with a really early choice to go into Gainar, you know, oh -ho, into the RC combo. Just wanted to get a little bit extra stock, and two might be able to take it. Now SKD is just going for all the optimals here. He's managing his resources. Oh wow, wow. Woo! Woo Woohoo! Dogra! Jumping right out of there. Dogra is content with just sitting there, getting a little bit of meter, because once well, he gets that 50. See, he's also sitting on his active flow. Yes. By getting that much burst back, even if he was to get hit earlier, oh, no. without capitalizing the active flow, he would have gone into the next round with a lot less burst gauge oh, yeah. to work with. That's a 5A. Oh, no. Recovered just in time, and now, that should be a round. Yeah, the, Ezreal putting out so much damage, so much damage off that counter hit. And actually with a, a burst advantage moving into the round due to that active flow. Yep. Oh, really nice, nice jump out. from Dogra. The 5B. Now, SKD does have stellar defense, but fortunately, you know, Dogra's offense just he constructs it in a way that makes it almost oh, impossible. Reka, Reka. And that's a big conversion. He still has a weak point converting into the kick step. 4.6 passive damage for Dogra. He's coming up on OD. Both players getting their burst back. Now, SKD does have four stocks to work with, but Dogra, I mean, azrael has got a lot of health. So that's one thing SKD might need to keep in mind. You know, it takes like, just a little bit more stocks. It's a little more expensive to kill him, resource-wise. Yep. Oh, wow. He's dashing into the, uh, the Saber. Interesting uh, Oki situation for SKD there. Axe Flow trying to get his burst back. And that's a knockdown. Four stocks is going to be plenty. Oh, oh, wow, really nice RC on the uppercut there. Dogra managed to escape the corner. He's going to burst out. He knows that SKD could kill in that situation. Ooh. Wow. Tricky, tricky SKD. Tying up around 1-1 one, on one our first game of winners. You can see the look of determination on both of these players' faces. And the round star OD from uh, SKD to just get those uh, stocks. This may not be the biggest tournament at Combo Breaker 17, but the level of anime has nothing lacking. Yes. You know, both of these guys have risen to the top of an extremely deadly competitor pool, and I'm really excited to see them showcased on uh, BG Flexo stream. 6A, 6B. Into the IAD. Whoa, yep. cross up. And that should be it. Dobro with a. Oh, no, oh, no he didn't. Buster. Wait, he didn't. He didn't. All right, there it is. Dogra with a perfect. Yeah, he, he was going to use the Gustav <laughs> to get the OTG hit. At first I thought maybe he tried to super and didn't have any meter, no, but no, no. yeah. That's, that's, a, that's on a different button. So SKD uh, now down one round, but this oh, is his winners. hand is quivering. Did you see that when he tried to drink his coffee? <laughs> <laughs> he was like... <laughs> <laughs> he shook. He shook. Don't get shook, Josh. You can do it. All right, OD. And I like the barrier out from uh, Dogra. Yeah, he, he managed to kind of escape what could have been a special cancel off the block string, giving yep. SKD even more special meter. Gonna get that weak point. And that mini 5D. Dogra with a strong showing in the second, the first oh, no, round of the second game. That's not the weak point. That's important, man. Uh, uh, Basra really needs oh, that weak whoa, point. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, punishes. 
Dogar might need to buy some measuring tape for his 5C. <laughs> Dogar now sitting on uh, another match, another clean round. Now this is going to be three out of five, guys. So even if Dogar picks up a second game, we have another opportunity to SCD, SKD turn it around. Now SKD and Dogar, both of these players are deadly players when it comes to long sets. Very deadly, very calculated. And we saw that earlier in Dogar's match in uh, Grand Finals with Guilty Carry. Did such a great job at, at adjusting to Bears' game plan. Yeah. And in, even earlier in this set, he did a great job of adjusting to SKD's early dominance. Yeah. And we can see right now that, uh, you know, he's, he's, just, he's still not afraid to block. Perfect defense from Dogar. Oh, but get hit. Oh, the Estrella. reset. All the way off the screen. Active flow with the damage jam. 3.7 is a lot of damage. For nice six feet. Him. He's one meter short of a four icer as well. Oh, oh but that 5B. five B. He's over with all the resources in the world. Gonna go for double weak point. Or counter hit. I know we're in a, we're sitting in an astral situation right now. If Dogger lands a hit. Into Astral, but it's safe jump by the jump A. <laughs> SKD picking up the time the rounds. One one. No, both these guys oh are man, look at that. They're just fooling around, guys. I don't even know uh, if this was a uh, grand finals or not. <laughs> I mean, that's the point of the game, right? Is to play. Yeah, man. Have some fun. Oh, that's a fatal. Nice confirmed, too. And really, we're seeing a lot more of the players because they're enjoying it so much. You know, they're really oh, yeah. they're pushing each other to their absolute limits, and it's this kind of competition that they live for. Oh, wow. Tucking and actually getting counter hit. Nice oh, block. Good defense from SKD. However, he's not managed to figure out how to get out of the corner here. Dogra's IED pressure is so good. I mean, you can look at SKD's barrier right now using that, uh, that fussy option play. Once again with a good block, Dogra kind of at a loss. You know, what exactly is he going to do? That's oh, Lord, the 3C counter hit. And with the active flow even. Oh, no. Messes it up. Dogra with providing SKD with an opportunity to land the round. But SKD, you know, oh, whoa. Uh oh. Whoa. Now, That's a DP. Yeah, that is definitely a DP. <laughs> he wants to make double sure. Whoa! He messed it up. He messed up the combo. SKD a little fray, but manages to tie up the game. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, you, you know, hey, that's the first time I've seen Dogra drink a non cola. Yeah. It that's was true. Pepsi yesterday, it was Coke at Northwest Majors. It was a Mountain Dew at Guilty Gear earlier today, too. Oh, yeah, maybe Mountain Dew is the flavor of the day. Scores tied, folks. Dogra versus SKD at Combo Breaker 2017. This is winner's final. This is definitely one of the most, uh, more enjoyable matches that I've seen in a while. And you just had a 6A to get past that Seraphim C. Look at the defense from SKD. Continuously barrier IDing every single one of Dogra's normals and forcing him to end the block from early. Great. Upper cuts out. Dogra, though, with a huge life lead. SKD's going to need to use those stocks to convert to some high damage. Whoa! Dashing right into the uh, wild the frame singer. trap from Dogura. Just wow. Uh uh. So we got the crowd chanting with the combo. SKD had such a great start, but you know Dogura playing Azrael, such an explosive character, easily able to convert off those high punish situations. And once again, in a situation, all right, SKD, almost oh, right now. He's got full um, easy. Oil. Is it called easy? Oil? The gate. The gate. Gainer. Gainer gauge. Yeah. He's got full gainer gauge. Catches the roll of the deep jump C. Dogra choosing to burst out at a really unfortunate timing. SKD and cleaning up the round four. Yep. The 1,000 damage minimum scaling of Horizon. Man. Now Dogra is down a burst, and uh, SKD is still sitting on his. Now the winner of this will escape the 1-1 situation and go into the third game with an easy lead. Uh -oh. Dogra getting caught low. Yet again. I'm That's not getting, sure why, how he's getting caught low right there. Maybe he's trying to opt like that. Could just be getting hit. SKD with a lot of stocks and Dogra without a burst. He's got overdrive even. Dogra's offense does manage to cost SKD a couple resources, but He's always a really hard character to stop. Whoa. All right. He's at EA. Oh, wow. Nice block. 
definitely looked like he was gonna cross under. Ooh. Now no no uh gain arc stocks anymore. And I believe he did absorb one of the D sabers, yes. so he does have Ooh. a phalanx. Like, the frame trap with the air surface. Oh, that's a fatal too. Oh man, SKD now up 2-1 at Winners Finals against Dogro. He seems to have hit his stride. You know, he was a little flustered in the first couple games, but he's definitely playing at a higher pace now. Dogro is so expressive. Like his face is always making some. Uh, yeah, man, that's uh, that's Dogro, man. I can never like, tell if he's like eating a, like a warhead or something. <laughs> Right, SKD once again with that Gainar, eight stock. It does cost him an early burst though, and that may be unforgiving against a character like Azrael with such huge damage output. Get that weak point back on him. Oh, it's a clean chain into 5D. Yeah, that's really hard to beat because even if you backdash, it's such an active normal. Good reversal fluorizer for SKD. He's going to pick up a lot of damage off this. Oh, wow, actually dropping, but that's fine, I guess. Gainart, once again. Really great job by SKD meeting Dogra out of his dash there. That was one of the things we saw Doza do to great success. Ooh, punish! Now with OD, Poryzer is actually going to do loads of damage on the way down, so long as he can finish the combo. Ooh. SKD on match point! Looking to go into grand finals, folks. Now, this is the reason why I think people should, people should always hold on to their burst because of situations like that. You can capitalize so much off of these OD reversals. Dogra with an early cross up 5A. But yeah, like you were saying, Alex, Overdrive and its usage has been such a long discussion about CF because, and I think it's a really good thing, you know, the creators made it a varied, um, a varied tool. They want you to have some personality about it. Yes. They don't want you just to use it because you're about to die. If it was something that would be phoned in, it wouldn't be as exciting, but it's one of the greater changes to the game. Yeah. Dogra with her, whoa, whoa. Whoa, messes up the SKD's input. And it should be a uh, game for uh, Dogura. Happily icing off the weak point to get into super here. Dogura. 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 SKD though still on match point. Nice. Still Dogura. has the burst. Multiple well, players have the burst. You see that OD again. Neutral OD. We're just seeing it so much of it. Hey man, it's strong. And uh, right there, you thought it was going to cross under, and then uh, he ended up in front of you. Max uh, stocking. Josh is getting just so many resources here. Dover though holding on to his burst. Okay, he wants to escape the knockdown. I don't blame him, man. That situation is very hard to deal with. Manages Jumps to out. get out of the Astria RC. Using that gain art. Very tense situation for Dover. And he's and getting oh. tagged by that 2C. That's so much damage. Uh, luckily, SKD does not have Vorizer on. Zack! Almost didn't need to RC. Oh no! And SKD moving into grand finals, folks. Dogura with an opportunity to return, though, using up his first life, moving down into losers.